Yeah, you got 42 minutes. Work with what we got. Don't fucking tell me what I have to work with. Whenever I want to fucking do something, I'm going to fucking do it. And if I want to go to Walmart, whenever I feel like it, I'm going to fucking go. That car almost fucking hit me. Fuck you. Who the fuck do you think you are? Who the fuck drives Volkswagens anymore, you stupid fuck? I do. I would. Well, fuck you too. You know, they make punch buggies. This guy's getting really close to my car. He might rob you. Why the fuck are you looking at my car? Shut up. Shit. Yeah, fucking turn around. Fucking yeah. Yeah. I don't know fuck what he wants. God. People at Walmart. It's fucking crazy, man. I don't fucking understand these people. This is like a new series. People will come to Walmart at God-given hours for one thing. <laughs> and they'll leave with fucking nine bags of shit. Pretty much like one us. thing that they came to Walmart for, they didn't get it. Well, we got it. I did. Yeah. The one thing I gave to Walmart for, I got. Yeah. And then I have three other fucking bags of shit. <laughs> it's about time we start moving. Don't insult my intelligence. Bye, Walmart. Fuck that BMW. Or that BW. BMW. Volkswagen. The same fucking thing. It's amazing how we keep doing this at night. See me. Right. Cause you know what? I'm fucking Batman. There's a truck sitting over there. I bet you that guy's jacking off the picture of Bruce Springsteen. Why Bruce Springsteen? Because he's gay. Oh. Not Bruce Springsteen, the truck driver. Just to get that clear. Love you, Bruce. Yeah, I also just realized that I was going for Bruce Wayne, but Springsteen was in my head first, and Springsteen came out. You know, it's also funny that I keep recording these in the upright position instead of the sideways position. You know what? You don't do things normal. <laughs> I believe I posted in the last video uh, an upright position too. It was an upright position. Yeah, and now they can't see me again. Well, I mean... But you know what I don't have this time? What? I don't have that goddamn accent. Thank God I don't have that fucking accent. I mean, just imagine if you had that accent. But the fucks are still there. Yeah, the fucks are still Woo! there. Yeah. The fucks are still there. You know how many fucks I give for haters? None. Really? Fuck them. That's awesome. Why are you trying to... Ah, don't talk in a fucking accent. I don't want the accent to come back. I don't know what you're talking about. Don't talk to me in that tone of voice. I don't know what voice. you're talking about. Don't look at me in that tone of voice, you stupid little boy. Don't steal lines from other people. I'm not stealing lines from other people. Yes, you are. But who the fuck thought that was a good idea to make a TV show? Whose line is it anyway? Half the time, they don't even fucking talk about lines from movies. They fucking act out skits. What the fuck is going on in that fucking show? You wanna know what's really funny? What's really funny? The fact that we're like recording this in pitchback. This is basically like a commentary to a picture of a black photo. <laughs> this is a fucking commentary. It's a commentary on a little thing I like to call life. And some people just don't have one. They sit at home and they stay on their computers all day, playing World of Warcraft, going on YouTube, trolling, doing nothing with their goddamn lives. Did you go to school? Yeah. What'd you do? You sat in school all day thinking about going home to play fucking World of Warcraft. That's what you fucking did. You fucking piece of shit. Is it, this, you go home, you eat dinner, which is like a pack of four Hot Pockets. You sit in your room for the rest of the goddamn night. You don't give a fuck about the homework because you don't care about school. And you sit on the computer and you fucking play Warcraft. Because you think it's so cool to be a level 73 orc with whatever fucking realm you're from. <laughs> and you think that it's cool to get online and do quests. No hating to the, any of my friends that may play World of Warcraft. Yeah, thanks. Fuck you, you don't play the game. I, I, I used to play it a lot. Way back when, when the free trial lasted for a week, I played <laughs> it. And it sucked. Oh, I it fucking it. sucked. This guy came out of nowhere, asked me to duel. I didn't even know how to say no, so I pressed the button and I was actually <laughs> dueling him. Next thing you know, I had to start over from a fucking graveyard. You know how fucking scary that shit was? This dude was chasing me with a scythe. Fuck that. I never want to play Warcraft again. Besides the fact that it's stupid. I got a question. Did you join for the same reason I did? What was the same reason you joined? The Aussie commercial. <laughs> you know what? Fuck off for whatever reason I decided to join. That's why you joined. That's why a lot of people joined. <laughs> oh, a rock icon. Let me join so I can play World of Warcraft with them. 
I bet she doesn't even fucking know how to play World of Warcraft. I'm Ozzy Osbourne and I'm the Prince of Darkness. Ozzy, there's only one Prince of Darkness. It's not you. Yeah, there is. Yeah, he is. Why is it not him? Because he is the Prince of Darkness. Exactly. Yes. In fact, considering right now it's dark outside and it's dark. Why are you talking so much? The last time you barely said anything. Fine, I'll shut up then. Shut the fuck up. I gotta, it's my video. It's my video. But it's my channel. Fuck you. It is your video. It is your channel. <laughs> it is my phone. But then again, whose world is it? This is the world we live in, and it's a piece of shit. No offense. Uh, yeah, yeah. I'm taken. Kind of is a piece that of shit. That wasn't to you. I mean, it's still, a, yeah, sure, you're right. You might want to put some heat on those windows. I am. Don't up. tell me. I put all the heat on my back window, not my front. That's why it's not going away. Watch. All the heat's going to go on my front window. It's about to be clear in like four seconds. Okay, well, maybe not that fast, because shit doesn't work that fast. Oh, hey, look at that! It's clear! Uh, I know how to drive a car! Besides, most people in this fucking city, when they see one little ounce of white stuff, and that's not cocaine, kids, it's fucking snow. Anybody in the city of fucking Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, sees snow, heavy rainfall, hail, or whatever God decides to drop from the fucking sky, they forget how to fucking drive. What about fire? He's not that angry at us yet. <laughs> Sure? Yes, I'm very sure. Uh, if he allowed Bruce Jenner to change his sex and Justin yes. Bieber to still be alive on this planet, he's not that angry at us yet. Quite yet. <laughs> but thank God that a guy who used to run a TV show called The Apprentice, and he thinks he's the shit. Oh, I have an amazing fucking idea. Let me run for president. You stupid, sabotistic, abusive, Dumbass, Mexican-hating, toupee-wearing blonde fuck. You don't know a goddamn thing about politics. If any of the fucking world's people think that they need to fucking put him in the White House, yeah. they deserve to not live on this planet. Because I tell you what, the minute that anybody fucking tells me that fucking Donald Trump is a president of these United fucking states, I will pack my bags, get my hockey skate sharpened, and go to fucking Canada. With because Justin I Bieber. tell you one thing. I'm not living in a country where a statistic, stupid, toupee-wearing fuck is running the country. You, know, you actually want to know something strange? The Simpsons kind of predicted the Donald Trump campaign in a lot of ways. And when he won, uh, the country went to shit. And I'll tell you what, if he does win, which he's not going to, the country is going to go to shit. But there you go. The country's already kind of shit. But you know what? They want to blame Obama. Obama does, has done a lot, and he's doing good. He's in his final year. Yeah, yeah, the thing. I forget who told me this one. I wasn't done. I wanted to sit my Dr. Pepper. Oh, okay. He's in his final year. It took him two years, what took Bush 10 to try. I'd like to understand... Don't fucking turn the light on. <laughs> still wants to be anonymous, sir. I am still anonymous. Oh, but wait. Let me label the video. Furman 77! You're the one who told me to label it like that. So you were saying about Obama. And Obama's things. doing good, and they want to kick him out, but they're not kicking him out because it's the end of his term. He did a lot. But when you think about it, presidents, they fucking get in. They try their hardest to get into the fucking video. Video. Fuck. The White House. Two years <laughs> learning how to fucking run the country. A year... To fucking run the country, and then of the fourth year, they gotta like, oh shit, I'm up for re-election. Let me get my shit back together and show them why I deserve to stay here. He said, "Fuck you all. Osama's dead. Put me back in this bitch." And they did. And you want to know something? Gas is two dollars and seven cents. Oh, it marked out from nine cents. Oh, nice. It is two oh seven. Where else are you gonna find two dollars and seven cents of gas? Cheats. This is true. This is very true. Sheets is a gas station. That's a Sheets is Sheets is a gas. That's what I'm fucking saying. <laughs> <sighs> but uh, I remember being told a long time ago that you know when it comes to being the president, this is like almost serious. But when it comes to being a president, you gotta think about it. They're just trying to clean up somebody else's mess. But that proclaims that there's always been a mess. Yeah, there literally has. When my grandmother said that Bill Clinton was in office. Everything was kind of good. Kind of. 
I don't remember but much. But then the dumb Clinton. motherfucker wanted a hand job on the job. <laughs> and look what happened. Bam! Impeached. And you know what? Everybody's surprised that Hillary wasn't on the front lawn, front house, uh, the front of the White House lawn like an episode of Cops. Get your shit out of my house, you stupid fuck! I hate you! I bet you do. <laughs> I'm sorry, baby. Don't throw my shit out on the lawn. Clinton's just kind of like pleading and begging. Like, what the fuck is going on? <laughs> she was just a temp, baby. I swear, Monica, you fucking home-wrecking bitch. And Monica, poor Monica. She didn't do anything. Was it Monica Lewinsky? Yeah. I don't know, but this video is definitely longer than last night. I'm sorry. <laughs> a lot of shit going on. All right. I'm done shouting. I'm done saying fuck for the night. <laughs> no, you're not. You just said it again. Fuck off. Say so you did it one more time. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> you did it one more time, man. What the fuck? Yeah, hey, what's it doing? He doesn't hurt anybody. Fuck, 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 fuck. That's a Camaro. <laughs> I need money. It's a Camaro. Oh, I'm a boss ass bitch. It's a Camaro. It's a Mustang. That was a fucking Camaro. It was a Mustang. Maybe, so it's, maybe it's a Mustang by Camaro. That cop pulled up here, kind of stopped, kind of slowed down when we were right here because I was talking, and then he fucking parked down there for a few minutes while thinking we were doing something. I guarantee he's going to go turn around and come back up this hill because he's a Forest Hills cop, and them fuckers don't belong in Turtle Creek. Yeah, I just give away my position. Thanks. I gave away everybody's position. <laughs> What's up, dog? <laughs> What's up, dog? Stop making gang signs. They can't tell if I'm making gang signs. <laughs> Don't fucking turn the light on. <laughs> what if all of a sudden I just pressed the button and a flash came from this way? That would suck ass. <laughs> that would really suck ass. It'd be amazing. I wish there was a flash. On There's a moon the in the sky, and that's obvious. Why don't you inform Does me? Does anybody even fucking live in that house? You know, as long as I've known yeah. you, I've never seen anybody come in or out of that house. Neither have I. The last known re residents we used to know. I don't know if they still live there or not, but yeah. I guarantee you they're in the house and they're dead. <laughs> Want me to go check? No. Okay. You know how Wait. they died? Yeah. Listening to some goddamn awful guitar playing from the other side. <laughs> Asshole. But the last time I've seen him was like when I was still in high school. I always used to see the um, the mom, the kid I used to know in that house. He was always walking and talk to the guy. You know what happened? Door. What? The mom would come outside. The dad would come outside. They'd be sitting on the porch. I don't think well, someone the porch. Stop! They'd be sitting on the porch. They'd be having fun. Talking. Talking about their day. The little fucking kid would run outside. Slip down the hill. Fall off that concrete ledge. Come through the come through the doorway again. And his mother would slap him across the face and say, Get in the fucking house, you filthy fucking little wanker! Why the fuck did you come outside? You don't deserve to see the light. If only they but knew. But Mumsy, can I see? No, you can't have nothing, you stupid, pathetic waste of life. <laughs> if only they knew that. If way. only they fucking knew how fucking rampage this gets. <laughs> no, I mean, if only they knew what the heck that, that, that layout looks like right now. They can't see shit. There's a fucking ledge and a fucking for sale sign. I guarantee you that fucking for sale sign's been there for years. I just noticed that, actually. And here's the fucking accent again. <laughs> God damn it. I have ice cream in the back of the seat and a movie I would like to watch before I go what to work cream? tomorrow. I bought ice cream, you stupid, pathetic piece of Where life. Where did you get ice cream? Where's mine? I didn't get you ice cream. It's Ben and Jerry's. Oh, my God. Are you kidding me? If I said gelato, whenever I was young, my dad used to slap me for using the word gelato. <laughs> yeah. And whenever I would bend my ankle or twist my shit, my dad would come in here. All we need is a pulse with some maize. We don't use that maize shit. The maize shit's never worked. Put some alcohol in this bitch. You should know plenty about that. You're doing. You're born during a prohibition. And there's the snap. Good night. <laughs>